Hey, my friend, welcome to my virtual mentor. My name is David. I lead men to go further faster in their faith in Jesus Christ. And this is a series of videos about the Freedom Summit. What is a Freedom Summit? Well, I'll tell you what it is. It's a, it's a personal encounter with God that has the ability to produce irreversible change in a man's life. Listen, I know that sounds outrageous, but if anything, that is an understatement of the power of God when a man's desire meets and collides with the power of the Holy Spirit, okay? And so I'm gonna share with you in this video a testimony of a man that's been through a Freedom Summit, okay? If you're uh, interested in finding out more about that, just click the link in the description to the Freedom Summit landing page to tell you everything you wanna know about that. But for now, let's get right to the testimony. My name is Jason Turner. Um, I, I experienced the Freedom Summit about four years ago uh, in a time in my life when it was pivotal. And I think that's really, that's a really strong statement. And I think it's pretty uh, universal because God's timing is always perfect. So I found myself in a situation where uh, what I really needed was freedom from a handful of things. But, you know, uh, anger had been kind of creeping itself into my household. Um, maybe some lust issues as well, um, you, you know, but it, there was a lot happening in what I considered to be a strong relationship with my wife. Um, and so, you know, when I made the decision, um, it wasn't God just whispering to me, hey, you need to go do this and, and find some freedom. God has a tendency to kind of yell uh, at me. And so, you know, I, I took the initiative to say, listen, all right, I got you, God. Uh, we're going to do this. And I think that's key as well, because men, you know, we have a tendency to say three words that are just detrimental and it's, I got this. Uh, brothers, you don't got it. I didn't have it, you know, and I learned that at the Freedom Summit. Um, the Freedom Summit will bring you freedom from soul ties that, that maybe you don't even remember were there, that, that you haven't recognized in years. That was a big thing for me as well. I, I had to lay some things at the, the feet of the cross and, and let go of them and let God have them and, and, and just in that, in turn, extinguish them so that you know they no longer exist um uh, just the entire experience will bring you a freedom that i don't believe that you can know until you experience it uh you, you know and so in that time in my life um what i went through and what i received from that was just groundbreaking um walking away from the freedom summits you know was something I walked away a different man, no question about that. Uh, and, and what that led to was me being a better father, a better husband, a better brother, a, brother, uh, a better son, a better neighbor. And I think that's all, I know that's available to all of us. And, and brothers, there's really no time to waste. You know, the one thing that we receive right now and the one thing that we have to understand is that, you know, we are not here forever. Uh, and, and every second, every breath, every moment needs to count. And this is a way for you to get in and to put yourself in motion. And faith always involves our feet, always. So God's gonna meet you there. He's gonna be there for you. Uh, he's there now and he always has been, but it, you're gonna have to take that first step. And, and if, I could, if I could give you one piece of advice right now, brothers, it would be do it. Don't hesitate. Take that first step. Find freedom. Find yourself, find God, find that relationship that you've been seeking, and it will it will impact every relationship that you have. It will impact every aspect of your life. If you'll just make this first step, open your heart, and let the Freedom Summit change you.